Welcome back guys and thank you for joining me in another series, the last series of Satisfactory. This will be my final factory. Okay. Uh, I will start the game with the advanced settings on because I want all the alternate recipe instantly. I don't want to go in there and uh, look for those hundreds. It's a pain stealing 10 minutes after them to be scanned. It ain't, it ain't for me, okay, so, no way. This is my favorite factory because this will be my final play into this game. Hub upgrade 6, landing platform hydraulics completed, freighter landing initialized. Congratulations, you have completed onboarding and achieved the absolute minimum skill level required of a fix-it pioneer. <laughs> fix-it looks forward to your future achievements because a future with fix-it is a future with you. Tier 1 and 2 milestones are now available in the hub, and biomass burners can now be built individually. Your first official objective is to initiate project assembly by building the space elevator. This objective will take a significant amount of resources, so Fixit recommends getting to work. Get to work, right. Well, you will get to work. So, I will not start ever. On this, this save file gets corrupt or I don't know, we have a DLC. I will not start another factory. This will be my final factory all over the map with everything. I wanna I wanna complete the game of course, but I will take my sweet, sweet, sweet time with it. Uh constructing everything like it should be in quantities bigger than what we need. Because in the start, before we're getting to coal power, it's gonna be pretty fast. But after that, no, no, sir. We'll go back and make everything perfect. Balanced power. I don't know. Already finished the game. Uh, know how the game goes. There were a lot of stuff that I haven't done in uh, our playthrough. The one which we just finished, basically. Um, like, I didn't do turbo fuel, okay, I didn't get the recipe for the blenders, unless, no, I, I got it, but it was at the very last episode. Scanned a bunch of hard drives in there, wasted a lot of time. Well, I can see my spot already. There's the copper, in there is the iron, life is beautiful. We're gonna check that, uh, the drop shipping here, see what we get inside of it. Oh, something else. Animals. They gotta be on pacifist there. I don't care about those. I'm sick and tired of playing with them. Where exactly are they? Options. Gameplay. Animals. Passive, please. Passive. Keep everything. Yeah, exactly. That's the way I wanna play this. It is gonna be really, really relaxed in here no hurry to do anything it is gonna be just outstanding so one other thing we gotta keep in mind here um i've chosen this spot because a bunch of resources and a bunch of space normally i wanted to go for that spot in there but there's a not there's not enough space to build i want this because i can build in the air and i have a bunch of space to spread out you know that's what i want uh i'm not the one who does the most compact buildings as you well know so having the space especially that i do a bunch of mistakes when i build and i have to revisit that just to fix those mistakes having the space in here is just outstanding you know, it's amazing. So these episodes will be always like one hour long, but I'm not planning to edit them too much or to cut them. If you're looking for some instant builds, you know, this is in the place. We have, when we're gonna unlock the blueprint designer, we have the blueprints that we made into the last game for all of our builds. So until then, we're gonna build 
normally like it does in the beginning. But after that, I want to use those blueprint, blueprints as much as possible just to reduce the building time instead of spending, I don't know, one hour to make 10 Mario frames. It's gonna take like five minutes. It's gonna be really good. It's gonna go really fast. But at the same time, I will not edit these videos. It's gonna be a, a really, really slow pace. It's gonna be like, let's go chill out and make something. I don't know. There might be episodes when the only thing that we're gonna go and do, it's a highway until the desert. Or, I don't know, put radars along the map. All, all over the map, you know. Stuff like that. So it's up to you. You wanna jump in? Okay. You don't wanna jump in? Okay, again. I'll post them. It's gonna be something like two, maybe three per week. I'm thinking of putting one episode up each three days. Always about one hour. Really chill. Just be in this satisfactory universe in here and make something that I'm gonna enjoy forever. Because as I already told you. I ain't gonna start another one. No sir. Already I think that this is my eighth or ninth world. This is gonna be the last one. Okay, so here we are, designated spot, cleaning all the brushes and everything, watching the hog, not attacking me, it's just amazing. I would like if they would have been on passive to be able to pet them. <laughs> Maybe they will add that into the game at some point. So having here four I think five, four or five, pure iron nodes. This is just amazing. This will basically satisfy all your needs to finish the game. Okay, as you upgrade your miners, this will be just enough for finishing your game. Is it gonna be enough for us? No, it ain't because I wanna go all over the map and build everything. I want to unlock all the recipes, I want to unlock, I, I want to do, for example, fuel, I want to have fuel production, okay, I want to have turbo fuel production, I want to have ionized fuel production, I want to have uh, rocket fuel production, I want to have a bunch of stuff being made, once we're going to get the foundation, we'll put the foundations, I think, I put that rock over there, um, in there, you know, how was it pinging? I cannot ping? No, I cannot because I don't have the map. In there, until there, we're gonna have a highway going all the way until the rocky desert in there. We're gonna have a highway going all the way into the desert, all around the map, all around the world. Don't have access to the map, of course, it's normal. Let me go grab that. Actually, I don't need to grab that, I'm still not right now. Let's put our hub somewhere, I don't know, in here, let's see, out of the way for now. Is there a node in here? No, perfect, we're gonna put it in here. For now, afterwards, I don't know, we're gonna change it at some point. But for now, it's just gonna stay in here. Why well, won't you go in there? The creature is in the way. Well, let's uh, take care of that. Would you please move? That way or somewhere. Thank you. That was a bug. I don't know why it made sound again. That's gonna be really good. I can work. I will not take that node. I will take those nodes for now. Make it real simple. Concrete as well. Well, hide the beauty. Missed it. How are you? So let's start placing down some production, okay? We're gonna have a mark one in here. This will provide us with some ingots, not much. And from those, we're gonna make some stuff happen, okay? Also, I wanna have one already on the copper in the other side. So, I'm not sure I think 
I want to unlock Mark II's just to be able to, I mean, logistics after that. Yeah, logistics. Logistics should be the first one to unlock in here. And then, uh, unlock. Hmm. I don't even know where to go next after logistics. I think ideal, ideal, oops, would be to have base building. Just because otherwise we will make a bunch of stuff in here for nothing, you know. This belt, I would like it to go all the way in there, just not coming here for the constructors. But of course, that means that I will run out of belts because just remember, we're not producing anything right now. Uh, I don't know how many constructors I, put, I can put down, but what was the fun with the crush ship in here? Yeah. Oh, we get some reinforced plates. Very good. Thank you very much. Uh, I will not get that hard drive. We get some rods, we get some copper sheets. Uh, there is some paste in here, hidden in the corner. It's called supercomputer. <laughs> really nice, really nice. Uh, unlock the mem really fast. Mm. Plates, very good. Anything else in here? I got a feeling it's something in here. Escaping my kinai. Uh, I would have liked to have some cables or some wires, apparently we don't have such thing here. Good stuff, let's go for what? I don't know, let's put the power in this one. I'm gonna put one constructor in front of it. this smelter in here, just to make some of that sweet wire. We'll see after the words when we... How we are going to deal with uh, splitting this. I think I'm gonna wait until Mark 2. But we could make it with Mark 1 work as well. Okay. Got pretty used with a, with flying bar here. Of course, flying is not an option right now. But it's good. I wonder if we have access to the biofuel yet. I think we can make biofuel already with what we have on us. Yeah, it's biomass. Wow. Well, at hand? Or... Well, we gotta do a few out here. Let's see. What are our milestones? So we get the base building. Perfect. We get the logistics, which is the most important stuff. Because able to split. We get the field research with the map. In the map, object scanner, very good. Inventory slots, amazing. Part assembly, not gonna go for that one yet. Obstacle clearing, yeah, because I want the biofuel. That's not so hard to make. Sink, yeah, I wanna unlock everything that is in that awesome sap. The awesome sap will be mine. So, first things first is gonna be logistics, okay? We're gonna just plug it in there and uh, wait for it because wait for it you know so I'm gonna leave myself some space in here everything will be rearranged at some point but for the time being it's just gonna be like this making some iron ingots in here let me drop those in there because don't need them on me I think uh, put a purple like in here Put another one like in here. Gonna run out of stuff soon enough. This will be a little power department here. Let me just clear out the space a little. And we're gonna put some burners in here. I don't know, two, let's say. I think it's gonna be more than enough at the beginning. Uh, after that, I think we're gonna need something like eight, maybe. Yeah, something like. Eight until we're gonna get to the core, but I'm not sure I wanna crowd them in here. I would like to put them on platforms out of the way, you know. Having in here a drop box for the leaves and for the wood, so that's two drop boxes. Because guess what, we don't have access yet to the 
smart leaders. And um yeah, didn't want to do that. Automatically making all that solid biofuel. Okay, let's take care of the power as you said. Let's put all them. Oh, already missing wire. Well, that's why I needed something in there. Will you sustain this stuff here? Let's put a power point here. Normally they should be able to sustain two miners, two smelters, two constructors without an issue. Let's let's turn those leaves into biomass. And just like this. I can't believe I got a supercomputer. Out of that place. I mean this is just outstanding. Amazing. Gotta love it. Uh, I think that should do it. So, one of the first production lines that we're gonna do is gonna be exactly this, you know. Turning this leaves and wood into biomass and then into biofuel. There's plenty here, 200, 200. So this one's give me 20. Oh yeah, it's gonna be enough. It's fine. So we're gonna have that boy starting, that one, and in here. What should we do first? I feel like plates. Uh, put another constructor, hello, in here. And this one, we're gonna make it right. For the screws, I don't know. I don't know yet, okay? I, I honestly don't know. I'm just gonna leave it like that. Once that boy is gonna get filled up, we're gonna put some some of that tasty iron in there. That's it. So this one gotta make him wire for us. And then we're gonna need another one. Just to make oh my god, I love seeing the iron wire in there. Having the alternate recipes unlocked. Oh my god, yeah. I'm missing cables. So I'm missing wires, I'm missing cables, I'm missing everything. Just be expected, I guess. <laughs> Our first production is going up. No stats, no nothing. Just amazing. Can I put down another miner? Yes, I can. Okay, let's go to that limestone over there and make it happen. You know? I'm missing cables because I put all these power poles in here. It's normal. Well, we're gonna let that one. I don't know where. Oh my god, here we are. Um, now I gotta make my way back. And guess what? Uh, I don't have nothing unlocked, basically. Good stuff. We're down now. <laughs> Welcome to the channel. This is PIG for you. Now I gotta climb all that mess up there. Well, we found some circle boards. Some berries. Gas numbers. Potential Status. edible collected. Eating it and surviving does not count as a valid field test and does Molds. not generate enough data for fix it to make an informed decision. Store this potential resource for later use. Well, didn't mean to come down here, but guess what? We're gonna grab this one here. Take a look at these flares. Like this and say, oh, okay. You're in there. This semi-slug species seems to persist entirely through absorbing and storing energy from its surroundings. Studying this could provide new methods for improving fixed production line efficiency. Store this potential resource for later use. So, from what I've seen in the last plate when you place the radars here, those two quartz nodes that were on this side, they're not in there anymore. They moved. They moved more to the east. In there, we only have two normal. Yeah, normal there. Yeah. Uh, coal nodes. The coal node that was up here somewhere is then. I think it was right above here somewhere. But this big boy is. Yeah, it was in here. So this is the spot where it was. It ain't in here anymore. So that's gonna be a little issue for our steel production, let's call it. Because that would have 
been just ostending the cavity in there. The fact that it's not in there anymore. Hmm, kind of bothers me. So we'll, we'll have to go out of our way just to grab the coal and bring it in here. It's gonna be a long belt. I don't know where exactly we're gonna get that, but it's gonna happen. Let's make our way back and try not to fall this time. That would be just outstanding. Uh, wishing for the jetpack, wishing for the cover back is gonna be so long. Oh, I don't have space to be on that. My inventory is filled up already. What do you think about that? I think it's just amazing. I picked so much stuff, it's just embarrassing. Well, let's drop stuff that we're gonna sink because we're gonna sink them so it's gonna be that it's gonna get sink and we have 54 yes numbers we're gonna sink that supercomputer gonna sink those taters i think we're gonna keep them all those but we're gonna sink the second ones copper sheets we're gonna keep them that's about it let's make more biomass Oh, we wanted to make. Sorry, I forgot. Uh, do we have your ingots? Nine out of three. How many are you consuming? Fred. Well, aren't you this? Yeah, you're in prison. Fred. This one. How many plates? 94. Well, we can have the plates. Uh, let's delete that and put it in. This one. We will start making some rods because we're gonna need 150. And with the wires, I think we're gonna have only here 300 for the logistics. I don't wanna build too much by hand if I don't have. We have 142 and 80 ingots in this one. Yeah, we're gonna need another one of this. Missing cables. Well, here we are. Can I put down a crafting bench in here? Yes, it is. Yes. Give me some of those wires. How many cables are this? Three. <laughs> I'm gonna make a little more because we're gonna need cables to connect that boy to the power as well. So, yeah. It is what it is. Plus, I wanna kinda automate cable production as well. So, that will have another one in there. Let's put this boy in here and one other in his face if we can. No, we cannot. Well, mm, don't like this. Can I get up on you? Sort of. Maybe. Perhaps. Okay. Like that would be this. So I want you to make me. Eh? I want you to make me cable. Nothing would be bad at first. It's fine. Don't worry about it. It's gonna be fine. How many wires we have? 32 more. We got 83. We need like 300 for the, our first milestone, which is gonna be logistics. Now, uh, let's watch where we're walking in here, how we jump in, because I don't wanna fall again through the cracks in here. Did you hear we felt, by the way? <laughs> uh, up and around we go through here and we made it to the limestone amazing oh man would you look at that view to my right it's just amazing you know and the beauty of this game that's something i didn't like in the last playthrough so i made one video per day each one one hour okay in order to produce that one hour video real life like i don't know others they have production teams stuff when you see they edit in their own videos like i am by the time you edit it you publish it you make it happen uh, at least three hours have passed by okay at least uh apparently i can build a belt until there which is just amazing gotta love it so not enough time, not enough time to do stuff, not enough time to sit in here and breathe it all in. All the beauty of this world. It is so beautiful, 
it's a picture. I mean, your factory, amazing, right? But look at the wall. Take a peek at it. It's beautiful. I love it. Now we're gonna have all that done. This being the final factory, we have all the time in the wall. Okay, all the time in the wall. Can I put a constructor in your face in here? Yeah, amazing. Let's align it somehow. Put it in there. Connect it to the power. I'm amazed that those are still working. Uh, we're gonna need you to make some concrete first. Please, kind sir. Thank you. Let's start with the boxes. We have boxes? We have. Okay, so you're gonna have to put your products. Let's go. Why isn't aligning? Oh, now it goes. Okay. Put it uh, not sure I want to put one in there yet because everything will be changed in here. We'll only add another constructor. Have you made some of them? 64. We got 200. Well, I think we can be ready to send up first milestone of the day. What a joke. As the night falls upon us, uh, the sun is just rising. How comes? Doesn't matter. It's perfect. So we're gonna put those. And we don't have the wires. We need 130 more wires in here. Let's see if we have them or not. I believe not. But yeah, it's it's fine. It's fine. Uh this place is not connected to the power, are they now? Let's invent the power pole. I'm missing free wire. Okay. Give me your hand wire. Let's invent the power pole. And connect these two boys, I just consume a bunch more cable. <laughs> this one make wire. This one make cable. Perfect. Now what we're gonna do is take those hundreds, plug them in here. And they will take care of it. Oh power. The maximum consumption is above our production. So maybe we should keep some. Oh, we can already put them back. Let's make two of those happen. <laughs> we were just talking about them. We already have in here this boy. I'm just gonna put them on the grass in here. So um, if I would have a splitter, I would put a splitter, but we don't have it. It's fine. We're just gonna go in here in the front. In front of this one. Something like that. Put it in here. Oh. At some point. Guess what? Uh, this one connected to that. To that. We will uh, put a splitter in here and feed into these guys. Okay. So this boy is gonna get his biomass in here. Everything will be nice and dandy. We're gonna have. Uh, <laughs> I should put in the other one as well. Is okay. Give me two hundred, please. Here you are, my boy. Right. Let's uh, take a step back. Let's make some bikes. Now we did put a constructor. Oh, I still have one automatic miner. That's very good. That means we can build another miner on something. I think it's gonna be on iron. I think it's gonna happen at some point. Gotta leave that slug. Maybe deposit those copper ores. Uh, no way, we can deposit those. Better make something with it. Right? Right. Let's make those copper ingots happen. So, what do we need? We need wires. Well, wires are in the making. Uh, we will do these copper ingots that we got in here, that ore into water because apparently we kind of miss it so at this point in time we're doing the things okay? we're doing the plates auto magic we're doing the rods not auto magic actually we're doing the rods auto magic but not plates we're doing the wires automatically we're doing the concrete automatically but we're not doing the 
cables. Nevertheless, we're building all that. What do you think about it? I think it's just amazing. I think I want to stop this boy, which is how many cables do I have? 22. It's not much. We have 28 more. Let's put this boy as temporary. That means that this either been how it today. That means that this boy was stuck wire on the wires. Because we we kinda need those wires to send them off. We have 80 on us. We need 120. Okay, 117 if you wanna be exact. I'll take those 94 and put them in here for this boy. He's got a hundred. Drop the rest in here. Even all of those, we have almost a hundred. Not long to go, and we will be able to send our logistics must. A hundred and seventeen. Mm. Really good. Really good. It happened. We got him. Let's send that mask on. We're gonna have to go back and grab some uh, stuff from there. Just make the splitters. What? We're all set for now. Come on, go. Milestone up. reached. Conveyor belts can now merge, split, and lift to save space and enhance the productivity of your factory. Fixit encourages you to consider investing in verticality when it comes to factory logistics. I will pay If you feel stressed by this complexity, imagine yourself on the shore of a vast and calm ocean. Breathe in. Visualize all the people relying on you. The sea is made of billions of faces, each staring at you with hope and tears in their eyes. Hope and tears. Breathe out. Feel refreshed and focused on your duties. So, uh, let's... Let's put those conveyors in here. Splitters, I want to say. So, number four. Uh, that one I'm not using. That one is reserved for the foundation. Okay. Let's invent one splitter in here. I cannot even jump on it. We need those blades. Okay. That's totally different story. We are making some stuff. I would like to have the man just to underclock this machine in here because it's making 120 per minute only consuming thread. This boy is taking 15 for the iron rod and this one should take 30 so maybe we should double that. Yeah, we should. Uh, missing wires, what do you know? So should we get base building or the man? I don't know. I think we should go for the base build. Because foundation, you know? Able to put everything in here, organize it. Uh, before putting 18 more of these. I think we should go for those foundations. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I think so. So let's invent another split on this one. And we can place one other. Having only marked once means that that one transfers 60. The other one needs 30. This one is gonna be always 30. Perfect. And that means we can have in here another one of these. Um strength. Is? Uh, give me another power pole in here. Power line to you. Making something else. We're gonna need screws, but I'm not worried about that. I want more plates in my because we're gonna start with the foundations. Okay. So this is gonna make plates. This is gonna make half of it plates. This is gonna make half of it rods. It is what it is. I cannot downgrade it. But the good news is that we're gonna have 30 plates per minute. The good news is that we already have 15 of those per minute. Um, we're gonna need another constructor here for this voice because um, reasons. So let's invent in there the merger. 
Uh, I don't like the way you sit. You just make that one clear. Number four. Splitter merger. Okay. Let's put it. Yeah. Can I jump? No. Puny you. Puny human. Okay. Organization. Container, please. Here we are. So, foundations will give us foundations. The man will allow us to underclock these machines in here. You know? And I think that's really important. Um, I think we should go for the map. Hmm, what do you think? I like to hear your thoughts in the real time. What do you think we should do? Well, we're gonna put another snug in here. That much is clear. We're gonna put the splitter in here. Um, this? Yeah, it's wearing. Somehow. Don't ask me how. But somehow it's wearing. Okay, need another power up there. Perfect. Uh, so, copper ingots, how many? 30. Well, you can go straight with that boy. Perfect. Now, this boy here, it's using only 15. We know, we know, okay, we know. We know that it's gonna take a million wire for that, uh, Space elevator build. So let's just do this. Perfect. Now these boys will make wire in here. Oh my god, it's so crowded. It's unbelievable. Let's invent that merger. Somewhere in the front, like that. Just for them, you know? Missing iron it's amazing. Let's go. It was to be expected, I guess. Let's put the splitter in here because I don't want to run without power. Perfect. Uh, do you have more for me? Yes. Give me some of those tasty as well. Perfect. Now, I want to have it here in my boxes. I think it's about time I rearrange my stuff in there because I keep pressing 5 for these guys, but it's not 5, it's 4. So, we're gonna make it like that and we're gonna put the lifts on number 4 because that's the way I usually have them, okay? Good, we were talking about uh, two of these. One of them in here. And one of them in here. Perfect. One of them will store this cable. One of them will store these wires that are gonna come. Please go in. The creature is in the way. It's been. Would you mind? Oh my god, don't tell me I'm stuck. Why are you stuck? I'm not enjoying this, Mr. Bean. What? Sh how should we do this? Can you get unstuck? Oh my god, please. Don't come here again. Ha! She's coming. She's coming. Perfect. We made it happen. This is the power pole. You're gonna have to do wire. Do I have ingots? Oh my god, so many ingots on me. Uh, let's put some in this boy as well. Perfect, I get rid of those units. Now we're making in here 60 wire per minute. They're going in there. We're making in here 30 wires, which are gonna be turned in cables. We could use another one of these boys in here. Making more wires. So let's split this belt. 
if we can somehow please i'm missing king well let's go grab some have we made some i guess they are on the line let's try not to follow game bhg that would be just amazing thank you uh splitters that's what we were doing In everything. The pioneer life. It's kind of difficult in the early stages. Okay, so this one is making Fred King. Am I doing the right thing? Yeah, because this one is only 15. So they both got in there and in there. Okay. They both need some power. Shoot. Not enough power balls. What? Well, we are. What made it happen? Oh, we with the power, by the way. Don't know. Don't wanna, don't wanna know, actually. So, if I'm not mistaken, this one, yeah, it needs 60 fires. So, we're gonna have to move you a little forward this time. Let's put him up here. Let's get up on it. Uh, actually, no. We're gonna put the merger in here. Uh, somewhat aligned, please. Thank you. Grab the wire from there. Grab the wire from there. Connect to that box. We are all set. Power wise, our capacity is 100 megawatts. Our maximum construction, uh, consumption, I want to say, 63. Apparently, I connected that one not to the power. So, let's invent another power point here just for him you know we will need to split that line of course and you're gonna have to make concrete for us gracias all wires maximum consumption 60 cents well, i think we can start automating the biomass production and If I would have had Mark II's in here, it would have been just amazing. Because able to put the Fred one in here. That one would be fed by a full six uh, uh, Freddy, I said. And put another one making screws. But it is, we don't have that option. Okay, so this is the stuff that is not stored in those uh, amazing boxes that we have everywhere. Because uh, it ain't in the right place. It's gonna be. It's gonna be modified. It's gonna be redone at some point. So should we get this one or this one? I feel like this one is more important in the beginning. I know. I want to put those as well, but for the time being, it ain't gonna happen. Issue. We need 300 screws. Oh, let's get in here. This boy, which is making the rods. Guess what? It's gonna make the screws. Because we already have our alternate recipe. So it's just those things. You know? It's making 50 per minute. Very good. In 6 minutes, we're going to have our screws. How are you guys with biomass? Loads, isn't it? Yes, indeed. Okay, let's put the biomass in here. Um, I kind of want to build the third one in here. Missing wires. More running around. But this time we have the boxes in here. Why is that one yellow? Oh, because that belt it's only a mark one. 60. And each one of them is hitting 45, so we could use that one being a mark two. Well, we're just gonna have to wait, you know. Give me those cables, please. Thank you. Oh, we need 300 screws. Have we made it? 40 already in the box, in the constructor. What do you think? I think it's just a standard. You know? Okay, I wanted to put another one in there. Preventive measures, you know. Drop all the biomass already. Did that BAG. Amazing. Let's come to our favorite spot in here. Favorite box. Put the slug in there. That's gonna be the first stuff we're gonna research. And I believe. I truly believe we're gonna need more than that. More than one. 
Okay, let someone, someone, automate the biomass production. Now that we have that guy in there, it's kind of fine, you know. I'm gonna put one constructor in there, one constructor in there. Put a merger in here. Going into this box. If I can, let me get up on the box, please. Thank you. Okay, mark one for you. Mark one for you. Mark one for you. May I have some power? Thank you very much. Here we are, consuming all the power that we're producing. Uh, biomass. Okay, you're gonna make biomass out of wood. Grab some wood. You're gonna make biomass out of leaves. Grab some leaves. Because I don't feel like doing them at hand this time. What is this? Container. Uh, we're not walking too much through there. So we're just gonna put them in here. Uh, one in here. One in here. How much wood do I have? Yeah, I have some. I have some. Good, 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 good. So the first one was with wood. This way. This is our wood boy. Here we are. Here we are. Grab the wood. Thank you. So that one is our leaf boy. Grab your leaves. I'm, I want to keep like a few. I don't know. Only a few. in here I'm gonna show you why in a minute I'm gonna come in here and drop those two to the ground it means in there I put the leaves I'm gonna grab some of the same stuff two of them out of here come in here drop those two on the ground um I put them up there I don't wanna have them up there I wanna have them on the ground definitely I know where to drop what to drop, you know. So you grab the leaves, everybody's gonna be happy. We just automated somewhat inefficiently, as you can well see, our biomass production. What is going, you know? It's going, we're gonna have the biomass in the box of ours in here. It's gonna get distributed between those three. I filled up. Mm, not quite. Well, I think I can connect it to the power already. Between these three biomass burners in here. And we have some power. Power is very good for what we need here. I need the pole. I need the pole. Good. She's online. How is sitting with the power? Capacity. One fret. Mass consumption 75. It's amazing. We love it. Need 300 screws and some more wires. We have 240 screws. Let's go grab the wires. Excuse me, I guess back. Uh, why don't I have cables in here? Oh, this boy is not connected to the power. Wow. Here we are. That boy, same. It's not connected to the power, but I didn't put the recipe. See, this is what I was talking about, stupid mistakes. I do them all the time. More than a thousand hours into this game. I'm still doing that. It's fine. It's fine. This is relax. It's not a race against time. It, no, there ain't nothing like that. Nothing like that. Man, so beautiful. Good stuff. Give me some more Christmas. I need another one. I think this is my first playthrough when I'm not doing screws by hand. Or words by hand. Or stuff by hand. You know? And it's just amazing. I'm loving it. What are you doing? Great. Give me some, because we're gonna need them. Thank you very much. How much concrete? 285. Very good. We will be able to start foundations once we're gonna send that master. Let's send this one with the man. 
Milestone reached. Supply the molecular analysis machine, referred to as the MAM, with local resources to research and develop new technologies. Potential technologies include exploration tools, weapons, and factory buildings. These are essential for maximizing your pioneer efficiency and alignment with Fixit's core pillars construct, automate, explore, and exploit. To advance Fixit's mission, all notable phenomena, resources, technology, or other influence should be investigated regardless of any perceived danger, as stated in the Pioneer contract. Mm. You get what the lady said? This one is feeling really. Why is that? Um, why aren't you building the cable, mister? I didn't put the recipe. Oh, how stupid is that? Well, you got wires now, and apparently you got a bunch. So start making them. Uh, how many cables I needed for the man? 15. I need 8. 1, 2, 3. One more, please. Thank you very much. Good. Let's get next to our hub and put the mem in. I kind of want to get rid of this uh, brush in here. In the back, we might have rats hiding in here, you know. They don't want them rat. <laughs> okay, get rid of it. I want to ride you. Like, really soon. But. Well, I think we're gonna need a parish for that. <laughs> so I decided to stop recording. I'll cut the video in here because the train was just passing right in the back of our little rent place in here. It's making a bunch of noise that you can hear in the video. So I'll cut that one. Okay, we got the band. Are you gonna talk to us? No? Okay, perfect. So, power slide. Here we are. Let's grab the power slot. Uh, you come with me. I think we're gonna need more and we're gonna have to make power shots. I think. I don't remember. I think so. Pretty sure of it actually. This one. We need one power shot. This semi slug, now dubbed power slug, is early in its life cycle and has retained only part of its potential energy storage capacity, giving it its blue color. Power slugs are capable of extracting latent energy from their surroundings, oh. including through a form of photosynthesis, and preserve it in their porous semi-crystalline shell over their lifetime. This explains why they rarely move after having found a suitable location. Where's the buddy? Where are you buddy? I wanna pet you. So this time, we're gonna grab these buddies. Good to know there is one here, I guess. Responding. It went away now. We're gonna we're gonna have them ours as our pets in here, our buddies, you know. Once we're gonna have everything littered with platforms in here, of course. Not before, because if you take it before, like now, you're gonna need those powder berries. I didn't have found any until now. Um they are around here somewhere, don't know where. But when you're gonna leave the game and come back in, those little doggos will despawn. If they're not sitting on a foundation, they will despawn, mister. It is what it is. That's the way this game is made. So, we grab that blue slug. We're gonna have to make a power shard out of it. The first be sacrificed for the greater pioneer. Good. This time, I wanna automate the synthetic power shard construction with time crystals. And diamonds and dark matter magicis. I don't remember what else. Overclocking development completed. Power shards can now be inserted into all buildings to increase input and output speed. Underclocking is also possible. Note: power consumption of overclocked buildings increases exponentially. So I would like that, but that one requires reinforced. Okay, in order to have the reinforced, either you do them by hand, which I think we're gonna do, or you do them with assembler. Assembler is the smart way, okay? 
let's see if I have 500 screws in there. I have 300, amazing. Well, we could make it happen. But I really want this one. So, this building, here we are. What do I need more? Some concrete, okay. Because I want to start building a foundation system. The more I stay here, the more machinery I put down, the more I'll have to delete, the more I'll have to rearrange. I'm not enjoying that a bit. So, base building. Here we are. Milestone reached. Several new structures are now available for improving factory organization. Foundations provide a building grid, which makes it easier to manage placement of any structure. In the event that you are experiencing amnesia for all events prior to planetfall, be reassured that memories of beloved humans and or animals would have only been distractions from your important mission. So we got the ramps, and we have the foundation. Um, sorry, gotta put this one on number one in here. Just like that. I got my hardware. So, I would like to make this guy's four meters in here. By the way, I don't think you noticed, but... It doesn't matter if you build it four meters high, two meters high, one meter high. The cast is the same. Two plates, five concrete. This is the way it's aligned to the world grid. And for this particular space, place, let's call it, this works wonders. Because it's kind of aligned with that ridge, you know. So, we're gonna start from there, uh, with the zoop, please, if we can. And I made it one minute, no. I just said, one in four minutes. Okay, I'm gonna go like that with it, okay. <sighs> Should we do it like this? Kinda high in there. Uh, that I think is the highest point. Let's try it from there. Yeah, I think that will work. Just perfect. Good stuff. So we just made our first foundations in here. Everything will have to be on the foundation. Or the other iron plates. We are already out of iron plates. Now this piece, all of it will be on foundations everything in here and this little hole of ours but this place in here i want it kind of empty i don't want to have machinery for the beginning of the game we're gonna have <coughs> those burners in there let's call them the miners and the smelters but all the construction magic game, I want it to go there eventually. I don't even want it in this space in here, I want it out there. I want it on this side, and I want it on that side. So that's how I think we're gonna do it. Nevertheless, long way to go until there. So, our next objective just to make our lives easier here is to have mark two logistics that's that's all there is so we can do it two ways unlock that or just unlock that if we unlock that one right now i'm gonna have to make by hand those if i unlock that one right now Ah, it ain't gonna be pretty because we're gonna start making those. We're gonna start making the reinforced plates, which I made in an assembler, and then those. But since I'm lazy and I don't want to build my hand in this old amazing, it's just amazing automation game. I'm gonna do the right thing. Change the recipe plan around just to have some more being made I grabbed those 500 screws I'm gonna grab some plates um, can you keep those for me? no? can you keep those for me? yes, thank you I'm gonna grab my iron plates out of here those will start working I need 200 kilo 
and we're gonna make a summers. Okay, because we need them. And those assemblers are gonna do well, the complicated parts. Like, I complicated. They're not that complicated. I could make them by hand. But the issue is, I don't wanna make them by hand. You, you, you understand what I'm saying here? Uh, before underclocking those guys, because it's making 120, they built 60, 30, 30. Uh, I don't wanna underclock those. I wanna leave them on 45. Have that one on Mark II build and underclock that one for 90. Same stuff in here. I want to have that one as Mark II build 120. Have another smelting doing stuff. Magics, you know? But. Of course, we need the reinforced plate for that. So. I feel like. We're gonna automate that thing. Like really fast. This one will be set in here for screws. Okay, it's gonna be 12.5 and 15, almost 30. We are making 30. We have those batteries. So, they will be kind of balanced in here in the back from this melter. And this is our only source of iron plates. This one is making the screws. This one is making the rods. Life is just beautiful, you know? So this is kind of balanced. Uh, I think I have more wood and stuff on me. Let's get rid of them. Leaves go in here. Wood goes in here. And now just forget about it, you know. There is one little cap here. This one's taking 60, but it's making 300. 300 is way too much for this town. But should we leave it like that? I don't know. That one, it's stuck up because it's making. And it's consuming a bunch of power. Okay, so we're going to put this one to make only 30. And we're going to put this one to make only 30. That's 10%. From 4 megawatts in here, we're going to drop down to a lot less. But having only those 30, 0.2 megawatts. I mean, we're consuming nothing right now in comparing sun with what it was until now. These boys will have all the biomass that they need in here. You can see they fill up. It's, it's, it's just great, you know? Uh, let's see. This one is taking 30. It's perfect. This one. 12.5. This one, 15. So it's 27.5. This one, no point in making 30. 27.5, okay? Because that's what it takes. Less power consumption first. Now, this one is making 120. You don't need it. You need 57.5. But I'm gonna leave it 60. Because I want 30 to go that way and 30 to come this way. Just to have that one filled up, you know? So that means, yeah, I think actually it should be better. Let's leave it at 30 and we're gonna have an excess of things that's uh, for you, I would like to have in there free constructors with the 120 belts. So we need that assembly. Okay, good. For you, I would like you to have free smelters in your face. Uh, two of them making wire, just like it's happening right now. Two of them making wire for this boy to make cable, just like it's happening right now. And two or three, I don't remember how many of them. Just make up shit, you know. But for the time being, it's gonna stay like this. We're not gonna start with the copper sheet, copper sheets production right now. Too early. It's too early for that. We don't need those. Right now, okay. But we can drop the consumption to six from five megawatts. We're gonna drop two megawatts consumption because we don't need that much okay. 60 but let's not forget about it 30 30 those 30 goes in here 15 15 those 30 are going in there 15 15 this are merging into a 60 belt of wire 60 belt of wire going into this one which it turn is making 30 cables 
for a minute. So it's just amazing. I'm balanced. It's happening here. 45 45. So we could draw that one. Making here only 10. Because that consumes 30. Making here only 10. Because that consumes only 30. So that's our belt in there of 16. At the same time, we gotta get back up there. Without falling my BBIG, that would be just amazing. And put this one on, you know. So, from 2, we drop to 1 mega. Or 7 mega. Or it's already on. It's already on. Perfect. So, let's not fall down. Don't wanna die in here. Or climb back all the way. We will have our foundations in here. Going that way with them, that way, that way. And um, I think in the next episode, how many of those we have? 370, 404. Well, we still need to deposit a bunch for the Mark II Mazda. Okay, for the part assembly. But this. So let's grab those. Let's grab those. Did I grab them? Yeah, perfect. Gotta put the boxes from for these guys because they're getting filled up in here. You know? Uh, yeah, you can have those. Don't need them yet. Those will be connected to our first assembler in there, just to make some reinforced plates. Apparently we're missing 23 rods for this master. And I have some copper sheets on me. Let's drop. They'll be synced. Yeah. That one will be used for building at some point. I don't need it on me. I got a bunch of wire. What do you think about it? Hm, just amazing. Now, beginning of the game, until we're gonna get coal, I'm not sure I wanna sink anything. Even if we unlock the awesome shot. Awesome. Because it's awesome. But I'm not sure I want to sink anything. Because of the power. Well, as soon as we're going to have that power. <laughs> things are going to be really different. You know? How many do I need? 23. We just have to wait for it. Oh, we are more than 1 hour. 1 hour 10 minutes. So... I think we're gonna send this mask on with the part assembly and that's gonna be it for this episode guys. I hope you guys enjoy it. I hope you guys like it this way, you know, chill like that. Ain't gonna do nothing special. There's gonna come a time when you're gonna say we got the power. We got the cold power, you know. And at that point, wow, well, things are gonna go a little different than what they are right now, you know, totally different. Milestone reached. The assembler can produce more complex parts, including the first project part, smart plating, which is crucial for initiating project assembly. Project parts must be delivered to the space elevator. By completing your contracted duties as part of project assembly, you will definitely be helping achieve fix-it company goals without any other ulterior motive. Note, mm. humans cannot craft project parts. Do not worry about your inadequate crafting skill when compared to an assembler. Fix-it cherishes your innate human abilities, such as walking, striking objects, and commodifying natural resources. What do you think, Alana? <laughs> I love it. I love it. I love it. I just love it. It is right. So I'm gonna have to build by hand some four rollers for our first assembly. In there. The audacity. <laughs> and then two more rats. Amazing. The audacity to make me build them by hand. Oh my god. It's just outstanding. But it's good. It's good. We're gonna have our first assembler ready here on this amazing platform that we just built making the mark the material okay so uh, screws and plates I think it was screws plates 
Uh, let's put them up because I'm circulating right here. Amazing. They're not touching too much. Hey, you're gonna need some power, don't you? Uh, yeah, let's bring that one in here. Now, which one? They don't take 6 and 12 to make 1. They don't take 18 and 50 to make 3. Of course, limits of the belt. Okay, so we're gonna have in here 5. Uh, four, three. <laughs> okay, fifty screws, eighteen iron plates. That's very good. It's gonna give me three of those amazing plates per minute. Amazing, isn't it? Now I think we will need one of those for the iron rods in here because at this point we're not using them for nothing. And I don't want that production to get clogged, you know, for the time being. Um, sorry, let me here. It doesn't really matter. Out of the way. And I'm gonna need another one. Let's see, in here. Come on, come on, you can do this. You can do this, BH. I believe it. For those reinforced iron plates, which you're gonna poop. Right about now, out of this machine, um, it's gonna take a million, uh, a million, yeah, a minute. <laughs> Only three per minute, so it takes 20 seconds to build one. A lot of time, a lot of time. Well, let's put a watchtower in here and look, see exactly what we have achieved today in our first little episode of our really long bridge okay really really long because it's gonna be let's exploit all the world <laughs> building as much as we can uh, exaggerating amount out of everything <laughs> for the, our final factory for example you need to build only 10 models to finish the game non-stop you might need more when you're gonna do the turbo are we gonna build only 10? No. We're gonna build a lot more. We're gonna make some in here on the spot on our platform for uh, our purposes, our needs, building other machinery. And we're gonna have factories, independent places, I don't know, which are gonna deliver the goods in here. If we're not able to do them with the resources that we have in here, and um, they're gonna get synced. This one. Kinda love it. Kinda love it. I love the way this looks. Even if it's ugly. Even if it's on the ground. Even if it's nasty. Hey, look at that. We have uh, the second batch of reinforced iron plates. We have six of them already. What do you think about it? those being automated in there means we can make that one mark two they will transport 120 limestone we're gonna be able to make another constructor in there have three of them and then that am i gonna drag it like that we're gonna make that long no we're gonna take these guys we're gonna go in there with them lift them up or not but just put them in there you know and have in there I mean, in there, our what should we call it? Factory for concrete. I'm not sure I want it on that level, so we might build some walls, go up or down, or just stack these guys just to be on the same level and have foundations in there and build the concrete in there and then drop it in a box on our platform, which is gonna be in here. Yeah, I think there's no idea. Uh, some stuff in there. Those I kind of want them going that way on foundations, not this way for sure. Don't forget, we got another copper node in there. Pure, always, it's up there. The quartz is just over the corner. Down there, we got that normal coal. What else? One single 
node of Ethereum in there, which is normal. That one, the pure one in there was removed. Already told you about the cover behind it, they removed. But it's cool, you know? Soon enough, we're gonna have to go after the Samoir. That one, I believe it's on here -ish. Far away in another galaxy. Maybe on that pillar in there. I don't know exactly where it is. It's gonna be a chore to traverse all of this, but it is what it is. Um, let's not forget that we're kinda, kinda in a hurry to go for the power. So I think we're gonna go with these foundations in there. Don't wanna waste them because we don't have an, a bunch of materials here. Okay, get in there, for example, as far as we need. And then drop for that coal in there. Come on, let me pass this. Uh, let's make it from here, just not the pole. I'm walking on thin air. So, I would like to drop in there first. Maybe. Or just put ramps and go for that coal in there. Stretch it, okay? Stretch it. In there. So, we're gonna have a platform on that water in there. Taking advantage of that node and of that node. Which are normal calls. The same arc we got it inside that cave. More quartz inside that cave. That's gonna be our first platform for power. Coal power, baby. Coal power. Yeah. So, apparently, from this one, if I put it now from here, if I put it, I can drop down and avoid that rock. So let's take a look at that. Ramp for me. Yes. Come on, go down. Go down. Yeah, it's gonna be fine from here. We're gonna be going with it. Can do the rest. Of course, we have we have a minute to go until coal power. But that doesn't mean we cannot prepare for now. We can come in here, we can make our platform, we can make plans, we can talk about it. We can call it our sweetheart. But it's gonna be a lot of time until we're gonna be able to do that. For sure. Uh, how do I want to build this? Above the water for sure. But if I place it, come on. In there is gonna be too much in the water. So, let's put it in here. For me, yes. that's kind of high for my taste. Let's make it one meter, drag it in, and bring it down. Too high for my taste. Bring it more down. Come, come. No, no, wait, wait, why are you doing that to me? Game. Chill. Uh, still above the water. In there? Come on. Okay, you can go like that if you really want to. Now that looks just amazing. Exactly. Just a tiny bit above the water. That's the level of our platform. Delete all that, put the ramp in here. Complete that one. Amazing. We will have our power in here at some point. Glad I wasted a million uh, plates and concrete on that. <laughs> to diffuse them up here, but it's fine. Don't worry about it. It's fine. Well, things are kind of coming along, wouldn't you? We'll take a look between episodes at that map and figure out exactly what we need to advance. Gonna focus on the plates, on the concrete, and um, I don't know. We're gonna start building more and more and more and more and more and more and more in here. Because we're gonna need all those plates. And we're gonna need um all the concrete for this. Guess what? We're gonna need them. Is it enough? Uh I would like to have three if possible. Yeah, free baby. 
That's the way to go. This will be our platform. Put the concrete in here. This is where we're gonna put this. Don't forget you gotta delete that belt, which is inside the cage. Oh, okay, good stuff. So this is where we're gonna produce our concrete. And then we're gonna drop it down there. We're gonna have three constructors in here, splitter in front of that. Everything will have to be replaced, of course. I'm gonna have to delete that belt, but it's fine. Ain't that difficult. Replace the miner. Put those in here. It's gonna be just a thing. A lot of a lot of work for our next episode. I will not lie. But I think we're going in the right direction. 27 and 10. Okay. Why it doesn't show me? Oh we got 27, yeah. It did show me that. Uh, no. So we have 27 of those Mark II materials. I'm not sure I wanna upgrade this one as it sits right now. In here, you know? I could use another smelter to make it more plates. That's the thing. Because at this point, guess what? All the plates that we are building in here are being consumed. Just to make a uh, marker, please. I cannot make it. Just to make those reinforced iron plates. And I think that's not good, you know? I didn't get that all, mister. So we should really, really start making more plates for us. This little setup that I just invented me here is gonna give us. Anymore. It's gonna consume more power. That's a totally different story. You know? Free. Give me another ball. You can barely wait to have everything placed properly. You know? Missing air. So already, already, we're missing. And now we're gonna grab one from here. Because life just happened. Well guys, I said that we're gonna leave this episode here at some point, but apparently that didn't happen because I'm stupid like that and I get immersed and I forget about it. Sorry for that. This first episode apparently is gonna be pretty long. We'll leave it in here nevertheless. Into the next one, we're gonna continue building whatever we're building in here. Thank you so much for being here for watching it. If you like it, don't forget to smash the like button for me. Subscribe to the channel. If you want to help me, support me. And um, if by any chance you want to support me even more, you can do that by grabbing yourself an amazing membership. Thank you again for being here. I'll see you in the next one. Take care of y'all.